Hello, and welcome to another edition of Oh My God, Guess Who's Dead. On <laughs> today's show, uh, we're featuring, featuring Lorraine Scott, famous fashion model from Iowa who was adopted and whose 50th birthday was one month away. I'm waking up. I'm waking up. Look at that. I'm waking up. In honor of Loren Scott's death, I have chosen to wear clothes today. Different from the clothes that I usually wear. Different from, different than, different from. I'm comfortable from. I have chosen something that remains drab uh, because I am. The word is not frumpy. It's something else. God, what is that word? It's not frumpy. It's not drab. It's drumpy. No, it's not. Dumpy. You know what? I decided that I must be fashionable now because if Lorenz Scott's death is going to make any sense, it should influence the world for the better. Here's what I think my, my style is going to be. We have to go with some depressing colors. And then we're going to have one sunny element. Why don't they have, like, neon colored cigarettes? I'd like that. Completely morose. Like, I'd have my tree day. My tree day, where all my clothes, like a tree trunk, you know? And then this would be the trunk part, right? I would have, my arms would be branches. And at the end would be green gloves and a green hat and green shoes for the grass. So then we move to gray and we think gray sky or gray matter. Is gray matter gray? What cheers up a gray sky? I'm not fond of the color blue, but if it was just like blue in the distance, right? And then we'd have to pick something that would be blue. My socks. It would be great. Isn't that great? That's not that great. Look at this little sun that's come and kind of came in. It kind of scared me because I was like, what the hell is that? And then I realized it was the sun. Just a little bit of sun. And also, it's um a painting. It's a Van Gogh painting of the... Um, uh, potato eaters or whatever it is. I just wanted to tag on an end note to show you guys the sun and just to say um, I, I would like to um, change my I don't want to change my style but I feel like uh, I, I maybe ought to uh, make an effort. How do you t you know when you wake up in the morning and you have to decide what to wear, and if it looks good, it takes time and attention. And you're putting things on and taking them off, and there's hangers all over the place, and your shit's all over the bed. And I mean, fuck it. Nobody remembers what you're wearing anyway, was my thought. Anyway, so uh, if you have any fashion tips, <laughs> I guess you could tell me about them. Tell me what you think. And I'm determined to stop wearing my father-in-law's pants. And I mean it this time.